what's going on guys welcome back to the channel baby anyways yes we are diving into a new the second part of stardust crusaders jojo's bizarre adventure and i am happy to say i am very intrigued to know what happens in this arc because um this part it, it's pretty interesting so far with the stands the crew that we've built all the characters are interesting and of course joseph is his usual self very funny um so i want to see what they're going to deal with now you guys said this part is better than the first and you can't wait so we're not even going to waste any more time here let's just jump in and i will see you guys for the review all right so that was the first couple of episodes of the second part egypt the egypt arc stardust crusaders man i like it i like it you know what i'm saying like I, I like it i'm not even going front like i don't you know what i'm saying i like it i like where it's going i like um, the stand that they went up against pretty, um, unique. I mean, all of them is pretty unique in their own right, to be honest. Um, it's pretty interesting stand. And to know that he still has eight more guys for them to go up against before they even see Dio, it's even better because I'm looking forward to seeing them go up against these different I'm more interested in in the stance power than the actual story that's going on that's how you know that's that's what Jojo does to you you know what I'm saying because as I said it's not anything the story is not anything deep it's a typical you know story you know family member sick you know gotta find a person who's responsible take them out kind of stuff so it's not surprising to me how it's going. What is surprising to me though? You know what I'm saying? What is surprising to me is that they introduced another animal um, with a stand. That was very surprising to me. I thought it was gonna be a one-off thing with the monkey on, and, and the ship stand. So that was very surprising that they brought a dog because I thought it was gonna be another person, another, you know, somebody that's like OP, that's like better than Avdol. And, and Joseph, but it turns out, no, that is not the case. It's a dog. And it's a dog that I think is going to come into play um, later on in the story, to be honest, are coming in clutch. It's good that, you know, it seems like him and Jotaro is going to have a very good connection or relationship going forward. So I'm glad to see that. Um, in all rights and in purposes, um Jotaro was right for throwing his ass over there because he was like he don't care if they die he's just trying to survive you know I'm not about that you know what I'm saying you're part of the crew I know he was forced to go there but at the same time you can't just see people dying and then just go lay down and fall asleep <laughs> you know what I'm saying like that's not cool at all and it's a very intelligent dog too you can you we know this so I'm definitely looking forward, man. I have much to say about these two episodes other than one more stand user down, eight more to go. And at the end of the episode, after the after the, the after credits um, scene that we saw, it seems like this one is able to kind of through pictures tell, you know, I don't know if it, I don't know if how that book works. It seems like as you're reading the book, it's writing your story. And it always ends up in a death possibly i don't know so i guess we're gonna get on an explanation to that in the next couple of episodes we're gonna next get an explanation to that but in any case man that is all i have to say about these two episodes really good start to the second arc of stardust crusader and i'm looking forward to seeing more of it anyways guys thank you guys so much leave a like on the video leave a comment and I will catch you guys next time for some more JoJo's Bizarre Adventures. Peace!